Hey everyone, Shea Bear 1000 here. Today, I'm going to see if I can cast this rod a few times out here in this little channel. Monkey's way up there. <laughs> she walked up there with Bruno. She's going to try fishing up there for a little bit. I'm going to try this little spot. Let's see what happens. All right, guys, stick around. Okay guys, so I got you on a different angle. I just put you on the other side of me. Got some chicken liver on here just fishing off the bottom. Uh, this is the road that takes you into where I took the uh, the tractor camping, this road here. I mean, it's back kind of toward behind you. Um, if I catch something, I better go get the net because it's pretty steep here this bank but I don't know if you can see that that's kind of a good sign that maybe someone's been stepping down in there and getting fish out I don't know we've never fished this um, it's just a little channel it doesn't seem to be too deep I just heard a splash I don't know if that's her casting up there or if uh, if that was a fish that jumped so yeah, we just thought we'd come out for a little bit. Getting cabin fever, you know. Monkey is too. I told her just because she you know I'm down don't mean she has to stay home. So, but uh, I hear her talking. She's making a video too. So, but yeah, I'm gonna make a few casts here and see what happens. We're just gonna kind of hang out for for a little bit thought you know we'd try it we never tried this place so it's a little breezy a little windy um, so I might try to cast out over there a little bit more in that corner I think I might because I'm kind of straight out from where I am now so I think I'm going to give it a couple casts and let's see what happens so if nothing happens it's going to be a short video <laughs> Stick around, guys. Okay, guys, so... Where's that? Right down there in the water is a big bobber. Whatever it's stuck on, it's really tight. And I know this, because I was cast out right about where I am now, maybe a little bit more towards that bank. And I got a good runner. It started taking my pole, and I barely got it. I grabbed my pole, and whatever it was was swimming around here I couldn't bring it in he kept going against my drag finally I got him closer and closer and he started going off to the right of this bobber and well it got around that bobber and well I had no choice but to let my uh, just to snap my line right so monkey here was <laughs> she's up there I don't know if you can see her umbrella where her chair is or not. She's up there. She came down and said at least she caught some. And look <laughs> what I caught. <laughs> I said, what'd you catch? And she said some weights and see that? Yeah. That's what we're using. Yeah. Um, <laughs> now how did it come off of there? The fish must have took it up there. I don't know. That's definitely mine. That is mine. That's my hook, my rig, and I know that it's mine because pull that off of there. That was the way I had to tie that sinker on right there last time we were out fishing. <laughs> that is mine. What are the chances of of me catching that? That is exactly that is mine. That's exactly how I had to tie them weights on there last time we were fishing. I thought it was a fish and I was all getting excited and this is what I pulled up with a bunch of weeds. And I thought, well, okay. How did it get clear? It, the fish must have still been on it. Must have been. And took it. That way. Yeah. Wow. But what are the chances of that There's, happening? I don't know. One, one in a million maybe. I, maybe even more. That's amazing. One in a couple million. I can, I can guarantee you that's mine. I can guarantee you that is well, mine. Well, this is ours. And I was like, oh, maybe, maybe this, you got This is that thing I pulled out of the tree. Yeah. Okay. That time. Oh, my God. When we were camping. 
And I can tell you that's mine because of how I had to tie that weight on there. And we're using this, you know, we're using chicken. Yeah, and, and yeah. we're using chicken gizzards. Yeah, so, God, that's amazing. Really amazing. Hell, I, I, guarantee I, I must that's be mine. a pretty good fisher. I guarantee you. <laughs> I, 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 I think you're bet, right. I would bet this car, my dog, my <laughs> wife, all my camera equipment, and all my tools that this is mine. I guarantee you that's mine. Isn't that something? Oh my God, that's something. That is definitely mine. Like I said, I can tell by the way these weights are. I use these weights, but this one I needed more weight. Uh-huh. When we was over at the river. Right. Which was... No, over straight, straighter that was the crow flies about a mile and a half maybe a mile mm -hmm. and I had to tie this on there like that well there you go I, I got it for you I babe. jumped up out of my chair and she said what <laughs> I thought there was something on there that I didn't want to touch <laughs> thank you you're welcome <laughs> oh my god at least I did something right today <laughs> wow that is something. What a story. <laughs> I looked at that and I was like, what? That looks familiar. Yeah. And I looked closer and I jumped up out of my chair. She jumped back, what? What? Yeah. Yeah. I was like, oh my God, I'm touching this thing. What's on here? <laughs> definitely mine. All right, guys, I'll kick you back on in a minute. That's definitely mine. Let us know in the comments below if you've had, I've had stuff like it happen before, but like right in the same area, you know, never, you know, 200 feet up. I'm getting a bite right now. Are you? Yeah. What do you want me to do with this? Put it in the back? Do you want it? Yeah, just put it in the back. Because I was fishing. Because she left, remember? She left a day before me. Valentine's Day. What about Valentine's That's when we went camping. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it was. And then she left, and I spent another night, and I put that rig on there because there's gar and stuff, a lot of things with teeth. So I put that leader on there. And how she got, how it got, it had to still be on the fish. I thought maybe the fish got off, but you can see, there's her setup right there. Yeah. Way up there, and I'll zoom out. It's like a, how long ago has it been since That's you probably lost it? 110 feet, huh? How long ago has it been since you lost it? Oh, probably an hour at least. Really? Yeah. Oh my God. All right, guys, I'll keep you posted. Good job, Monk. Huh? Good job. You're welcome. That's <laughs> unbelievable. That is unfreaking believable. Wow. All right, guys. Okay, look at this idiot. Second time she's been passed here. Dogs off of leash. Letting them run right beside her golf cart. The hell's wrong with people? She'll get way ahead of them and then stop and holler for them. Idiotic people. When she came through the first time, she came past here and then stopped up there. And, oh cool, there goes the, stopped up there and that one dog was, yeah, let's see. Let's see what they're gonna do about this. Didn't say a damn word. Didn't say a damn word to him. To her. You gotta be kidding me. Jesus. What the hell? But if we have a turn signal out, by God, you better watch out. They'll take you to jail. Oh, well. 
Anyway, yeah, that one dog was over there messing with monkey. Monkey's trying to fish. And she's just letting her dogs. I mean, granted, they're friendly dogs, apparently, but geez, you know, you don't. I wouldn't let my dog run up to, to a total stranger when they're trying to just sit back and relax, enjoy the day fishing. I can't believe they didn't say a damn word to her. Well, look, I don't know. Let's see if I can pick this up. There's the dogs. And she is way, way up. Well, she's already around the corner. She just went around the corner, and there's the dogs. Jesus. But no, if somebody would hit, hit one of her dogs, they would be at fault, according to her. You know, you know that's, a, that's a Karen right there. I'll do what I want when I want. But the rest of us got to follow the laws and the rules. <sighs> Stupid. So I just went out and talked to Monkey. I guess that big dog went in the damn water twice, right beside her. The woman didn't say a damn thing to that dog. What the hell's wrong with people? That's ignorant, totally ignorant. You know, people trying to out here, come out here fish, you let your dog jump in the water and bother him, knock things over. <sighs> Jesus, that's ridiculous. Stay away from my bait. Okay guys, we got one here. Nice, nice bluegill. Not eating size though. So he'll go back. That gator's watching me now since I pulled this out. So let's go ahead and Put him back in over here so the gator don't get him. I gotta go get that. There's one. Okay guys, so we're leaving now. It was a great catch. <laughs> Unbelievable. Unreal. <laughs> Only me. <laughs> that was funny. So, thanks for watching guys. Sorry it wasn't more exciting, but I am uploading this because that's a great story. Yep, I'll be yeah. able to tell my grandkids. But Well, it's true. Yeah. It's a true story. That's it what is. really happened. It sure is. All right, guys. Shea Bird, I'm at the Man of Legend. I'm gone for now. We'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye, guys, and take care.